time for a showdown. Two teams who thrive on pressure and performing on the big occasion. Now they get their wish. Fans the world over are fully focused on this atmospheric stadium where the drama is about to be played out over the next 90 intriguing minutes. Who will prevail? Keep it right here for live coverage on EA TV. And good evening to you from the Parc des Princes here in the French capital, Paris, the venue for tonight's action. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable cause. It's Paris Saint-Germain. And they face Al Nasser. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And the PSG team looks like this. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Lucas Hernandez plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Kylian Mbappe starts with Neymar in the wide positions. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, it's a back four, a narrow midfield three, and a very disconnected front three. But if the midfield players give good support to the central striker, this 4-3-3 system could work really well today. Well, the referee opting for the lenient approach this time. I think it's a great bit of refereeing. Everybody now knows the next foul will be punished. Well, Neymar really is one of the greats in the world game. Stuart, interested in your opinion as far as this match is concerned. What should we expect to see from him? Well, Derek, we know he's got great creativity when he's on the ball, but when he gets a set play in and around the box, he's got great technique. He can hit the back of the ball, he can bend it over the top of the wall, and usually he makes the goalkeeper work. Brozovic. Can he convert? Vital intervention. A lot of pressure applied. Can they take advantage? Lovely work to get past his man. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Decides to shoot. And stopped there by Marquinhos. Oh, skipping away. Well, PSG could get in behind the defence. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Might really be able to trouble them here. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Mane. Lionel Messi Mbappe with it Mbappe Alex Teres It's with Anderson Tariska Mane What a commitment to defending Neymar playing with purpose and control. Terrific block. Well, the fans want to see a shot. Determined defending. No foul. PSG advantage. Great opportunity. A smart stop here. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead.
It's Neymar's corner. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. And he takes it on. Got in the way of it. Being... Pressed here. Anderson Taniska. Al Hanam. Brozovic. Well, with tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action potentially. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. And that was a very fine read. Plenty of support here. Brilliantly blocked. And drawing it back. Well, he tried to put everything into the shot, but couldn't find the target. Nuno Minj, not giving him a moment's peace. Marquinhos. Well, there's a living, breathing example of positional sense. Tellez. And PSG using width to good effect. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. a free kick that's going to linger long in the memory unfortunately yeah and the less said about that free kick the better i think anderson taliska the ball back with psg now that's a good looking ball well the supporters think it's on oh and a goal from Cristiano Ronaldo cometh the hour cometh Ronaldo well here's the replay and as you can see Neymar's cross was always going to be threatening but just look at the space he has he doesn't even have to jump of course it's a good finish but the market is woeful The match has restarted, 1-0 here. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Well, we saw what was going through the mind of the referee, but in the end, she says free kick. Went in strongly to win the ball. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Opportunity. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, as you can see, he's a great talent. What a run, what a goal, and what a play he is. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Abdul Fattah Adam. And so the half-time whistle has gone here at the Parc des Princes in Paris. 
Well, there's a reason why we're highlighting Cristiano Ronaldo. He's been very creative out there, Stuart. Well, I... Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Cutting off the supply. Promising sequence. But quick thinking defensively. Giving it a try. And that's a very good parry. the chance they could get caught out on the break here and finally up a cul-de-sac Cristiano Ronaldo attacking possibilities for PSG superb block oh he's given us away has a go in it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. It's going to be a thrashing. 3 0 now. Anderson Tariska. Mane. Oh, he looks threatening. Oh, that is a moment of pure quality. A goal for football lovers to enjoy the world. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish showed great composure just to lift it over the goalkeeper. That's a lovely goal. So on with the action. And 3-1 the scoreline at the moment. Very quick thinking there. Seco Fofana. Plenty of options. A chopping challenge. And the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. And the keeper takes charge and dealing with the free kick. Donnarumma. Hernandez. Went in strongly, decisively. Anderson Tavisca pulls it back and putting his body on the line. Oh, that is a superb save. Oh, another one for them. And with plenty of time still remaining, this game is very much back on. Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. Underway again, and we're being treated to plenty of goals. 3-2 at the moment. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Really good interception. Anderson Taliska. And passing it through. Can they keep it out? 
Yet another tremendous save to add to the list. Neymar. Messi. And a strong tackle. 20 minutes to go in this one. Can they trouble the opposition this time? The cross is on. Now, who can he pick out? And the flag has gone up just when he looked ready to pounce, perhaps. Well, he was just too static in the end, which is a shame because that was a dangerous situation. Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, looking to increase the lead, but not accurate enough there. Yeah, that was half a chance to extend their lead, as you mentioned, but they couldn't quite take it, could they? And into the last 15 minutes of action. Anderson Tavisca. Can they square the game? And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Played in by Brozovic. Well, he read the flight of the ball brilliantly, but just couldn't quite keep it down. Narrowly over the bar. Vitor Ferreira. And nicely over the top. Superb block. And a corner for Paris Saint-Germain. What can they do with it? Fired in by Neymar. Appear to be in two minds. He'll take this on. Well, the keeper kept it out with a minimum of fuss, but it wasn't a great effort. Ali Lajami. Anderson Taliska. Brozovic. And unable to keep possession. Well, the fans want to see a shot. A mischievous effort held on to by the keeper. Well, he made that far too easy for the keeper there. It's not a great effort, is it? Mane under pressure. Doesn't seem to be bothering him. Well, the final whistle is almost upon us. PSG would dearly love to hear it. Will they get the win here? Stuart, your thoughts on their performance? Well, their attacking play has been excellent today. However, by throwing so many players forward, they've looked vulnerable at the back which is why this will be a nervy finish. They just need to hold on here. Neymar thrives on running at defenders. Messi. And blocked for now. And we are going to have two additional minutes. And the goalkeeper's touch, that was crucial. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. The delivery from Neymar. Well, they had the confidence to try the bicycle kick, and it was very nearly a goal. Well, what a piece of skill that was. It's a brilliant effort. Beautiful pass. And there's the final whistle, and we can confirm a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, no getting away from it. The real catalyst for his side tonight, Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals.